OMG y'all, I hope it's not crooked, but even if it is, we gonna make it work. <laughs> Okay, so y'all gonna see Gina a little later. We're gonna give y'all a hotel room tour a little later. We about to kick out Gina's birthday weekend. Her party is tomorrow. So I'm kicking it off with a party prep haul because I had to go to Dollar Tree. I had to go to City Trends. I went to CVS and we had to go to Cirilla's. So I will go ahead and do this little haul for you guys and kick it off and the vlog will be posted later on. Um, Y'all probably get it Sunday, but stay tuned. And if you wanna see exclusive clips and pics, make sure you follow us on social media. It'll be listed down below. Hit that bell and subscribe and comment, rate and share. But yeah, y'all, I've been ripping a run in since 9.30 this morning. I'm tired as fuck. But one of my little homeboys just hit my phone. He about to bring Bay a bottle for her birthday. She's gonna be geeks. Um, there's a, a couple of surprises that are gonna happen tomorrow. Well, not a whole bunch, but Bay has no idea, so it's gonna be dope. I can't wait to see her face. And we just gonna have a lit weekend, regardless. We gonna vlog it, and I hope y'all have a good weekend along with this. So let's go ahead and get into this haul. I'm about to take a little quick tokey toke to kick it off with. And yeah, so I hope y'all had a good week, a good work week, and it's Leo season. I'm excited for my baby's birthday. She's turning 29. This is the last year of her 20s, and I had given her a book a while ago called The Defining Decade. I don't know if y'all remember it, but I had read it, and she's like, oh my God, <laughs> it's the last year of my 20s. And it's so funny because two years ago, I was in the same fucking boat. So I was like, girl, you gonna be all right. You gonna be all right. I was like, if you thought your 20s was crazy, bitch, wait till your 30s. Because so far, I'm having a fucking blast, okay? So I'm excited for Bay. Um, it's only a few people that were invited. Only a few people are actually able to come. So we're just trying to make sure that we do our part for the community, especially with COVID still active. But um, it's just a small girl gig together. It's going to be real cute lingerie and pajama theme. It's going to be so cute. I can't wait for y'all to see the vlog. But I don't want to give too much away. And y'all just going to have to stay tuned for the vlog, which won't be posted until Sunday because I got to record anything we do tonight everything we do tomorrow and yeah so just stay tuned but i wanted to at least get this out of the way for y'all while i had the time Bay just got off work she went to go check into the hotel and then she's gonna come by so we can get everything in the car and then we gonna go get some food but we ain't really doing too much tonight but tomorrow a bitch gonna be busy, okay? I had to go over to my mama's house today to handle some business. And my mama gonna link up with me tomorrow so I can go get the cupcakes for Bay. So, I'm more excited. I get more excited for other people's birthdays, but when it's my birthday, I don't be thinking twice about it until it's my actual birthday. And I'll be like, eee, it's my birthday. And then, but before and after, I don't be giving a fuck for real. Like, I'm excited for Gina's birthday, but, you know, around, the, this is a bittersweet time for Bay. but I'll let her tell you that in her, you know, in her own way, but I'm excited for Bay's birthday because she just got a new job, she just got a new car, we're working on getting a new apartment, there's just so many opportunities that we've been blessed with, and I just want her to enjoy her birthday weekend. So. She already got one early birthday gift. She's getting her second birthday gift. And then I'm going to go. <coughs> I'm going to go and um, get her birthday bottle later. Um, so, yeah. What I wanted to get her, I figured it could be something 
that I wait to get. Because I was going to go ahead and get it. But I was like, that's silly. You know, I already got her the perfume. You know, that was technically supposed to be her big main gift. So, I'm going to just wait on it probably for the holidays. But as long as my baby have fun. So, I'm playing hostess. Y'all, I'm playing hostess and entertainment. Don't ask. <laughs> Don't ask what the entertainment portion is. But y'all know, I'm going to make it work. Okay. Let's get down to this haul. Because I still got to straighten up the apartment, make sure it's secure until I return. I mean, we ain't going out of town. We literally going to be up the street. But I have a certain type of way. I'm OCD. It has to be a certain type of way before I leave. Y'all, this is what I be carrying my pre-rolled blunts in. I actually had a pre-rolled cone in here when I went to Cali. So that's what I keep it for. Okay, let's start with Sorella's. So we went to Sorella's yesterday, and we gonna throw this in the goodie bow. Because my mama, bless her heart, my mama's so cute. I get my festivity functionality from my mama. Yes, I just made that whole phrase up. But she gave us some plastic bowls that she had so we could borrow them for the party so I can make goodie bowls. So we went to Sorella's. Gina's gonna go and get some condoms later so we can put them in the goodie bowl. But we had went to Sorella's and got like this type of stuff this type of stuff like all different types of stuff what is that? Uh, we got a garter we got some lubricant we got some like we got all types of fucking shit y'all like for the goodie bow and we just thought it would be so fucking cool to have all this in the goodie bow with some candy and it's first come, first serve, but like, and I'll put some suckers in here that I already had. So we're going to put all of that in the goodie bow. And then here goes some more lube. Ooh, is it candy? Is it flavored? Oh, oh, dude. <laughs> this is... <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited for the goodie bow. I'm actually going to put everything that's going in the goodie bow in this Cirilla's bag while I'm at it. Kill two birds with one stone. But that's what we wanted the goodie bow to be. This party is all about Bay and her personality and her sexuality and just being cute and girly and you know, just desirable. So, that's the Cirilla bag. I'm gonna keep that over here so I can get it together. So then I went to Dollar Tree because I was like, bitch, we need candy. <laughs> so, y'all, I think I went a little crazy in Dollar Tree. <laughs> Don't judge. But I was like, I want to make sure these bitches got all the candy. Okay, so, and they can give it to their kids and stuff, you know. Okay, so I got some peppermint. Cause you can't be sexy and your breath be foul. No, that's not cute. So, I got some Laffy Taffy. That Laffy Taffy. I got some Dum Dums. You gotta have some Dum Dums in your candy bowl. You gotta have some Cry Baby. Uh, you gotta have some Cry, Bur uh, Cry Baby Sour Gum in there. You can't have a party without suckers. These are the Blow Pop. Well, not the Blow Pops, but the Tootsie Roll Pops. These are my favorite. I'm going to have to steal a couple of those. I got some more Dum Dums. I try to get two of everything. My mama taught me to get two of everything. Like, did it. She was like, if it's not two of everything, at least get two additional bags. <laughs> like, that's how my mama taught me. Y'all, I got this really this. But yeah, I got all that stuff. Let's just start a little bit. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to organize, but at the same time, I'm trying to hurry up. I already took my shower, so I'm just chilling right now. 
Okay. And then I was like, at first I wasn't going to get no chocolate because I was afraid it was going to melt. But it's not hot outside today. It's actually gloomy. So, I got some Kit Kats, some Snickers. The early bird gets the worm because I only got a pack of pizza of those. Like, yeah, they were a dollar, but I'm not trying to have all that chocolate go to waste. So, got that. Okay. The cashier was like, oh, you about to have a party. <laughs> I got some popcorn because we are going to check into the hotel tonight. So I'm going to want some popcorn. And I had to get the movie theater butter flavor because this is the shit. Like, ain't nothing like that movie theater butter. I miss the movie theaters, y'all. Like, I want to see the last installment of Candyman. And, like, I'm, I don't know how I'm going to see it if the movie theater is not open. But I do miss the movie theater. Okay, so um, I got some aluminum foil. We're going to need that. I got some shot glasses just in case. We did, we are providing liquor, but we did tell everybody it was BYOB, bring your own bottle, or BYOS, bring your own shit. But, you know, I did want to at least make sure that I had shot glasses for everybody, whatever they bring, choose the drink. Um, this is actually going into one of the giveaway prizes because I wasn't happy with just the two items that were in this one particular prize. So I got this to be a bonus item. Yeah. <laughs> so since I'm the hostess and I am a fucking mermaid, I am going to have a hostess mermaid pin because I am in charge of games and I am going to be keeping score. And speaking of which, I need to write down the answers to one of the games so I have it on hand. But yeah, I just love this pen and it was a dollar, so I got it. <laughs> and then I got these for me and Bay, mainly me. Um, it's a sour pacifier. And her favorite color is red and my favorite color is blue, so yeah. So that's everything. I'm about to put I'm about to put me and Bay stuff in a separate bag. Like the stuff that's just for us, putting it in a separate bag. Okay, moving on, moving on, okay. Y'all, if and when I ever do have kids, this is gonna be my favorite fucking thing to do. Probably because it was my mom's favorite thing to do for both of her daughters. She loves doing our birthday parties and yeah. So the other bag, the stuff that I got from Dollar Tree is just the simple shit, like cups. We are gonna be in a suite. It does kind of have a kitchen, so I'm pretty sure there's utensils. But with Corona going around, look, at your own discretion. Cups, plates, napkins. The theme is black and gold. I didn't like the gold utensils. For one, I couldn't reach them. They were too high. <laughs> and for two, I was trying to get the fuck out of the Dollar Tree. The one particular location I went to, they was wilding. I had to get out of here. So I just grabbed some gray as a contrast color. These are the goodie bags for people to put their candy in. I only got two because, you know, some people most likely gonna put it in their purse or they gonna forget or so I was like 16 bags should be enough because we're not even gonna have 10 people so got those oh darn it well I'm gonna see my mama again tomorrow um my mama got this movie I gotta give her her package I forgot to give her her package but I am seeing her tomorrow anyway so and then I got these because I'm going to be doing some type of decoration with these. So I got these. So that's all I got from the Dollar Tree. I'm proud of myself because I only spent like $29. That's a record for me. And it's all going to get put to use. So I'm, I'm cool with that. So if you are planning like a small get together, unless you need elaborate wall decorations, don't fucking spend a high-ass Walmart, Target fucking prices 
on utensils and shit. Y'all don't Dollar Tree. Excuse me. Y'all, my sinuses have been bothering me. Oh my good. Honestly, it's my nose ring right now. But I'm good. Trust me. Alright, so that's got that stuff. Candy. Got that stuff in there with the Cirillas. And this is me and Bae's bag. Okay, cool. So, okay, this needs to... I'll put that in the prize bag in a minute. This is me and Bae's stuff. Because I got to take them both back to my mama. She will kill me. She will kill me. Okay, so... Yeah. And that's going back to my mama. This is my mama's bag. <laughs> right here. Crazy. All right, so I went to City Trans and CVS for me. <laughs> so from CVS for the party, I did grab some tape. I got some tape. I got the candles for Bay. The two and the nine. I got hand sanitizer, baby. You already know, if you ain't got none, I got you, okay? So yeah, that's all going to the party. But I went in there to see what lippies they had. So I went to Old Faithful LA Girl and I got this lipstick in height, bitch. Ooh, it's like a fuchsia pink. It has like, I want to say some red undertones, but I'm thinking about mixing it with another color anyway, but it's still cute. So I picked that up. It's in the color height, really cute packaging. This is cute. And then I got a lip pencil to go with it. This is the Shockwave Neon Lip Pencil in the color, what's the color, bitch? Fiery. Uh, okay hype fiery that's a whole stage name anyway <laughs> and then i saw this new brand called jonah and i just got a lip gloss in fairy dust and it has like a little shimmer to it it's like iridescent shimmer but yeah that's all i went in there for at cbs put that in my suitcase Y'all, I only spent, I, I've only spent like $80. Well, I spent $40 because we went to El Nopel last night. Yes, yes, I was craving shrimp fajitas. But I only spent $40 today on all of this shit, including the stuff that I got from City Trends. So I went to City Trends and I have, I have pajamas and I have a cover up, but it's still kind of revealing. It's like a sexually negligee cover up. So it still has like cutouts, it's see-through. So I was like, I want a robe, <laughs> I want a cover up. So I got this set, it's a three piece set, but it matches my outfit. So it says, hello gorgeous. And it's a fuchsia pink color. And it's just a little mini robe that I'm gonna throw on with my outfit. But I'm gonna save this pajama set because I can always wear it for pajamas. It's just some lip stamping. I think I am gonna take it all together in case I get tired of my first outfit. I can just throw this on and still be cute, bitch, and still be cute, and still be cute. So that's all I got from City Trends. Oh, I lied. <laughs> I lied, I'm sorry. The last thing I got was some sunglasses. I really want the big ass sunglasses that just look real good and Jimmy Neutron-ish, but I saw these and I was like, bitch, I'm feeling Foxy Brown Little Kim vibes. And they were only $3. And I was just like, bitch, I'm rocking these. Like, these inspired me. 
And for three dollars, I was like, "Fuck it, I'm getting them." Like these is real cute. Yeah. So I cop those. Eh, they gonna be cute. I don't know. She don't like. She, me and her, we don't. We like the same sunglasses, but she don't really like bulky sunglasses. Matter of fact, I just put this all in here. I'm a very organized individual. Very. Okay, so um, I got some more masks. My mommy bought these for me. My mommy is everything. I have an extra mask that I've never used. It's still in the package. I'm actually going to put this in a prize. Um. These are for me. I have so many masks, but I, every time I see printed masks, I grab them. Like I grab them, and that's it. Is that it? That is everything, y'all. Whew! I'm so proud of me. I didn't go crazy. I wanted this square-looking trunk type of purse, like real trunky type of purse, but they wanted thirty-two dollars. $32.99 at City Trends. They were tripping. No. I picked up my laptop. It's ready. Um, they moved my training class from the 4th to August 11th. So I start my new job August August 11th now. But my computer is ready to go. My daddy got me a headset. Um, and I already got a mouse. So, yeah. I did everything I needed to do today. And this vlog is about to be lit. So stay tuned. Make sure you leave your birthday wishes for Gina. And I'll update her Instagram name down below now for y'all. Um, because Gina Gets Locks is now no longer available. Okay. But I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And I'll see y'all in later videos. Check out previous videos if you haven't already. Alright y'all. So Gina just called. She checked into the hotel. It's about to be lit. Um, she's on her way to come pick me up. I got everything packed. I got our party bag. It has our games, decorations, and prizes. Our utensil bag. And then me and Bae's one night, like overnight bag or whatever. So packed up, ready to go. I washed the dishes. We just got to take the trash out. Uh, Y'all, this is my running errands outfit. I got this crop top from Ross. It's just a white crop top. Got on my pink joggers from Victoria's Secret Pink. And then I got these jelly black sandals from Forever 21 when we were in Columbus. They were cheap. They were like eight bucks. So yeah, this is what I was looking like today with my mask on, of course. So yeah, those are bay slides. Don't mind that. That's the DIY project that I'm working on. But I'm excited for Bay. Really, really am. So we are ready to parse her. <laughs>